We are at Ken's Lake, south of Moab. We're Trish and Randy. Welcome to our van build. Plus, where to go, what to see. It's adventure time. A few miles south of Moab, Utah, which is a few miles south of Arches National Park, sits the civilized BLM campground of Ken's Lake. This is a very popular fee campground with designated sites that you can reserve on reservations.gov. You are surrounded by majestic red mountains, four by four trails, biking, hiking, equestrian campgrounds and trails, uh, lots to keep you and the family busy. We're going on a jeep ride above the falls and to the other side of this mountain range. Spectacular! Okay, we're heading on up the mountain. Okay, this is right above our campground, above the waterfall. This trail is called the Steel Bender, and we're going to read here about it. Uh. The dog got out on her own somehow. <laughs> okay, oh, so they're giving gosh. you an idea of how difficult it is. Extreme ledge. Okay, let's see. No, okay, where are we? More difficult, right here. We're there, and... Okay, so it gives you an alternate. This is a six out of 10. Mm. Straight through nine miles with North Loop 14 miles. Uh, but is there anywhere to turn around if you needed to? Extreme ledge, use caution, no bypasses. Wow. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Sounds scary. Look at that. We are going that way. We'll do it for a while and hopefully we can turn around if we need to. So fantastic. The Steel Bender Trail connects to the Sand Flats area east of Moab, but it proves to be a bit too scary for us in the Jeep. A guided OHV tour would be great. Okay, so this is the road if you decide to do the steel bender. This is what you're going down. Right into the water. 
Okay, so even if we went one direction, we'd have to come back up this direction. And you know how a GoPro flattens things out. This is freaking steep. A little bit further down the dead end road. This looks like a slot canyon. Looks very interesting. Oh, it's not a slot canyon. It doesn't continue. But look at that. So the water comes right down through there. I bet that's spectacular when it rains. We did so much in this area that we have broken it into several videos. Oh, through the water! Okay, so we came to one end and look at these caves. Ooh, that looks very interesting. The falls are visible from the campground, and the biggest surprise was that they're fake. They're the biggest fake falls I have ever seen. They're gorgeous. A small dam on the other side of the mountain creates a reservoir with a pump that supplies Faux Falls, which cascades down toward the campground. Hit the like button if you want to explore this area. Okay, we're going to do the upper falls. gone up in elevation about 2,000 feet above um, Jens Lake into the LaSalle Mountains and that is snow 
It is snowing up here. If you have a four wheel drive, this is a fabulous spot up here. You can go from warmer spring flowers to falling snow in about 30 minutes. As always, thanks for joining us. We will be posting several videos from this area. Subscribe and hit the bell icon if you want to be notified when they are uploaded. See you on the next adventure!